welcome to Miscellaneous Monday, where today I'm going to be doing a very, very requested video because I'm going to be showing you my guitars. A lot of people have asked me to show the guitars that are in my background, and I have finally decided to do so. However, I am not going to play them. I actually played guitar in a Q&A that I will have linked down below. I'm not sure which one it is, so if you want to see that, then head over there. I have always loved music and I think I've been wanting to play an instrument for forever but somehow my mom just wouldn't let me. She had bad experiences with music classes so she didn't want me to go through that but eventually I finally got to own a instrument. I was very happy about that and I instantly knew what I wanted to play. The drums. Bet you didn't see that one coming. But the drums were too noisy so I couldn't get them so I had to pick another instrument and obviously it became the guitar. I love my guitar so much, but I just, I'm not good. I don't have enough time to practice, I just haven't practiced enough and I really should because I love listening to guitar play and I wish I could do it, but I'm not that good, so meh. But without further ado, let's actually look at my guitars right now. The first guitar I ever got is a really, really crappy guitar, but I got it for my birthday and it was this guitar. It doesn't even have a brand. and. This is way too straight to actually play it, and I just, I don't ever play this anymore. This was really my learning guitar, and when I got this, I knew that I wanted to get a proper one. So the next guitar I got, I really wanted an electric one because I didn't own an electric one, and they sound so incredibly amazing. So the second guitar I got is this one. It is the ESP LTD M200 SR, and SR obviously stands for Skulls and Roses. I love this guitar so much. It is my favorite guitar and it has an amazing sound to it. I bought this myself. I spent so much money on it, but I do think it was worth it because I enjoyed this so much. So what I like about this guitar is the way it looks, obviously. I mean, come on. I like skills. I like roses. Don't judge me. But I also like that it has a really cold sound. It sounds very weird, but you have a warm sounding guitar and this is completely the opposite. So this is really great if you want to play like hard rock or really not warm sounding songs. There is one thing I absolutely hate about this guitar and usually I take them off but I see I didn't do that now and it is the locks it has here. So the locks are here so you don't have to tune it that often and that you can actually do that right here but it is so incredibly hard to do that. It might just be because I'm an idiot or something like that but it is so incredibly hard to do so and I really don't like that about this guitar. So most of the times I just take these off and just tune them with this and then I'm good to go. But besides that, this guitar is amazing. I love the sound and it makes me happy. Let's move on to the other guitars because I have more somehow. I'm horrible at playing, but I own four guitars for some reason. Don't ask. So at this point in my life, I still had guitar classes and I only have the guitar, the acoustic one that I already showed you, my first one. It just wasn't doing doing anything. It just wasn't working properly. Therefore, I couldn't really continue my classes unless I got a different acoustic one. So I got this guitar and it is so amazing. As you can probably tell from the other guitar I just showed you is that I was kind of an odd person in the emo scene phase of my life, so I really love black, so I had to have a black guitar. But I mean, come on, isn't this awesome? It is black and it has a white lines over it and it, it, it looks so good. So this is an Ibanez guitar and I can't tell you which one, but I will have it on the screen right now. I love this guitar because of the shape it has. It is very, very easy to tune this one and it sounds so good. You know, once it's tuned, because it's not tuned right now. I love everything about this, and especially I love this because it is semi-acoustic. Which means you can plug it in and it won't sound like an electric guitar, but you can plug it in and that is nice. Actually, there is not one bad thing I would say about this guitar. So now we're left with the fourth and last guitar, and that is this guitar. It is a vintage VP6. I absolutely love this guitar and it is so incredibly different from that one because that one has a cold sound to it and this one has a very warm sound to it. When you play it, you immediately hear the difference and I love the sound of this because it's just for different kinds of songs. I actually got this guitar from a discount store because they use this in a store where people could actually play it but there were no damages whatsoever and it was still priced down so I was totally okay with that. This vintage VP6 is so incredibly cool. I absolutely love how it looks. This is wood 
which I think looks very very different. I love the shade of wood it is. The shade of wood does not exist. Now it does. I also love the white here because it's not just a plain white. It has a little of sparkle to it. It's almost like marble and I think it looks so good. This guitar is also very very easy to tune and very easy to play. It feels very smooth and I absolutely love it. So this is my fourth and last guitar. So yeah, there you guys go. Those were the guitars that I had to show you. I really hope you enjoyed it. I got this request so many times, so you're welcome. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and leave me a comment down below. Do you play an instrument? If so, what instrument do you play? Also, I'd like to know, out of the four guitars I showed you, which one do you like best? As we're just talking about looks here, I actually like all of them except for the first one I got. That is just like the very plain, very normal one, but the other three, I just love them. They're all so different and I just love all of them. It's so weird. Also, I want to say that I don't really play guitar anymore, but I do sing. I'm not the best, I'm not great, but I just wanted to offer you, if this video gets 25 likes, I will sing for you guys. Oh god, what have I promised you now? But yeah, since you seem to be interested in that, I thought you would also be interested in the singing, so just let me know by pushing the thumbs up button. So don't forget to share this video with your friends if you enjoyed it because it helps me out more than you realize. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already because I'm doing videos every Monday and Thursday and I would love to see you again then. Bye bye. Hey there, so today it's Thursday which means I have a tutorial for you guys. However, this week I was running very late, I had no clue what to do and I was almost ready to give up. But this